I'm the calculus professor and today I'll be talking to you about arc length. In problem number 33, we'd like to answer the question what differentiable functions have an arc length on the interval from A to B given by the following integrals. The first integral is the integral from a to b of the square root of 1 plus 16x to the fourth dx. And the second is the integral from a to b of the square root of 1 plus 36 cosine squared of 2x dx. Okay, so this is a little bit different type of problem. I'm not trying to calculate any arc length. I'm just trying to say, well, what are the functions that would have this arc length? And the only thing that I know gives me some information about the function here is this term. Because in an arc length formula, what is this term? Remember, the formula for arc length, L, is integral from A to B of the square root of 1 plus the derivative of the function squared dx. So this guy, 16x to the fourth, uh, let's look at part a, 16x to the fourth must be the derivative of my function squared, right? So the derivative of my function squared, we know is 16x to the fourth. In other words, if I want the derivative of my function, then that must be the square root of this. But the square root of that guy is actually plus or minus 4x squared. And it needs to be plus or minus because if I took the positive one and squared it, I'd get that guy. And if I took the negative one and squared it, it would be that guy. So both of these derivative functions would produce this term. Okay, but this is the derivative function, not the function itself. So to find the function itself, I need to take an antiderivative of this guy. So f of x, in this case, would be, well, what's the antiderivative of 4x squared? Bump up the power, divide by 3, and I get plus or minus 4 thirds x cubed plus some constant c. So if my original function were any function of this type, plus or minus 4 thirds x cubed plus any constant I want, then this would be the equation for my arc length. And so this is exactly the family of functions that I'm looking for to solve part A. Now let's do part B. In part B, I'm doing the exact same thing. I just have a different uh, derivative squared. So in this case, f prime of x squared is 36 cosine squared of 2x. 36 cosine squared of 2x. So similarly, if I just want to know, okay, then what's the derivative function? Then it's going to be the square root of this guy. Well, the square root of that guy is plus or minus, that's important, 6 cosine of 2x. So if I want to find out what is my original function f of x, I'm going to have to take an antiderivative of this guy. Well, sine's derivative is cosine, but when I take an antiderivative, I need to divide by 2 to account for the chain rule of derivatives. So I get this must be equal to plus or minus 3 sine of 2 x plus any constant I want. So the original functions or family of functions that would cr generate uh, this formula for arc length are plus or minus 3 sine of 2x plus c.